Crowd still filing in in Atlanta. Howell flush from the pocket. He'll have the first down yardage and a lot more. And this is what Sam Howell does. Jeff Sims, I think, is David Shanahan on the field for the first time. Downs back deep to receive. Number 11 gets his tips on the ball. That punt's going to be blocked. It was blocked. Tech recovers, but North Carolina will get it in plus territory when we come back. Giovanni Biggers tried to sneak in there. May have gotten a fingertip on it there, Tim. When you're giving him extra attention with a player inside and over the top. After the stop by Thomas, they'll run it with Howe. Another first down hey, for about, Carolina. How about, how about there that? he goes, Sam Howe for the touchdown. The Are you move. serious? The initial move is From space. 23 yards out, North Carolina on the scoreboard first. And how about that? First look at the move in space. Keep on, on, on the zone read. That's an excellent job. And then running through contact. Wesley Walker there. McCowan motions out. Pressure. Down goes Yates. Miles Murphy. That's a loss of 11. And what do we say about the single digits? Creating running lanes for these backs. DJ Jones on the field. Morales in motion. All night for Howe. Well, he wanted to unload one deep, couldn't get there. And he was tripped up by Quez Jackson down to Kelsey. Sims is now healthy after an elbow injury way back in week one. Inside handoff, Gibbs with all kinds of real estate. Jameer Gibbs off and running. First big play of the night for Tech, ushered out at the 48. That's a gain of 28. You know, he probably didn't need to interfere with them. No roll Yates out. Could be a holding call. Let's see if there's a flag down. There is not. Pass is caught. Kalani Norris reels it in. That'll move the sticks once again for Georgia Tech. Officially 33. Sneaks that one just through. No Tech on the scoreboard. Second play of our second quarter. I think one of my favorite parts of this past week getting ready for the game. We talked with Mac Brown. And I asked him in several different ways. Oh, and then Hal fumbled it. Hal fumbled the football. It's picked up by Georgia Tech. Quez Jackson has the Yellow Jackets in position. Jordan Dominic forced the fumble. It's a 23-yard return. This Carolina defense does another job of holding the Yellow Jackets once they get in the red zone. Yeah, another win for Carolina's defense. Tech showing a three-man front. Six in the box. Time for Hal. Pocket collapses. First down, North Carolina. Another big gainer. Well, these receivers can do so much damage. It was Antoine Green working against Jalen King, and he gained 36. I am surprised that there, there haven't been more opportunities to touch the football. We've seen Sam overshoot his receivers a number of times. He'll take off. Driven down. Brooks is healthy. The ball popped out. The ball came out, and there goes Tech. The turf monster prevents a touchdown. Demetrius Knight was thinking about it, and he fell down inside the 20, and we have a lot to unpack on that sequence. Actually come out. See Sam Howell as he's going down. Knee is not down. The ball comes no, out. That is a fumble. The ball looks like it is out because he is on top of the defender. Body Knight. It's Brooks again back into the game after the being field, shaken up. Second and four. Sims is going to take off a wide open lane to the end zone. And Georgia Tech scores from 11 yards out. A spark from Sims, cheered on by Yates on the sideline. Yellow Jackets have their first lead. With an easy path into the end zone. How about Yates on the sideline? I was trying to tee you up on that too, by the way, so you could tell everybody they were going to take a shot. Here's Sims on the ground. There he goes. Sims, first down and goal, Georgia Tech. A gain of 38 yards, and here come the Yellow Jackets. Carolina's trying to substitute. They weren't even off the field. Sims. Sims had the football. That should be a touchdown. At the end, to punch it in. With the Yellow Jackets. After falling behind 7-0 early. Five minutes into the second half. Chandler. Another nice cut. 
spins his way across the 30. He's run the ball four times for 48 yards and two touchdowns. That's his first completion. I think if you're Carolina. Oh, the slant was open. Oh, it still was caught. He still caught it. What a play by Malachi Carter. Kind of the confidence with the ball in his hands as a runner. After a gain of six, second down and goal. There goes Gibbs. Touchdown Tech. And then, you know, for the touchdown, it's Jameer Gibbs just doing a good job of playing with some power. End zone. Morales has it, and that's a touchdown for Carolina. Talk about the hands working against Tariq Carpenter, his fourth reception of the night, and that one counts for six. Job of getting his body inside. A little arc release, see him club the defender by, and then get his body inside, and then what a beautiful throw by Sam. Sims to the air, wants it all. Front pylon. Touchdown, Georgia Tech, Malachi Carter. From 27 yards out, he tiptoed down the sideline, just inside the pylon for the score. Carter going up and being competitive through the football. We kind of talked earlier about, you know, the moment of truth when the ball is there for these North Carolina DBs. McMichael is there. Ruling on the field is a touchdown. Previous play is under further review. Here's what happens. I think his knee comes down out of bounds, but prior to that, his toe hits in the end zone. Let's take a look here. It looks like it ends up being his right knee is going to go out of bounds, but his right toe. Oh, man. I, I think clips the grass right there. So that right, that right foot, that toe touches down before the knee hits the ground. The call on the field was touchdown, so it has to be, of course, indisputable. Video evidence. I don't see enough there to overturn it. Go for two to try to make it a 21-point lead. A little Philly special in the ATL, and it counts. Give them two. Leonard caught it, and P.J. Harris threw it. For the score, and then you're right, a little bit of Philly special to get this crowd going. And Green was wide open two plays in a row. Kyle Kennard with the sack on that last play. Howe slings it deep, has a man. Pass is caught! Carolina with life. Emery Simmons, it'll be first down and goal. You got two downs to get the touchdown here, right? I believe so. Howe, open, is Downs for the touchdown. Josh Downs. Carolina right back in it. Then a really good job. You see, you know, Downs does an excellent job of losing his defense. And wide open, it's going to pay off. Big man touchdown. Now the Tar Heels connect on a crafty play to make it a 13-point game. Doing anything to get the football back at this juncture. Second and five. Mason. There he goes. Jordan Mason. It'll be first and ten, make it first and goal for Tech. She was stopped all the way down at the five-yard line, a gain of 29. And Samaglia boots it through. 38-22. Round of applause from Jeff Collins. At that point, still perhaps a chance to avoid the onside kick. How backside pressure. Lost the football. Who has it? Jared Ivey crashed the pocket. Tech thinks they recovered it, and they did. That's hard to overcome. They've done it, and they've done it with playing great defense. Sims. There he goes. Jeff Sims to the end zone. Another Georgia Tech touchdown. And then how about this to finish it? The 50-yard Closer. And here comes Georgia Tech and head coach Jeff Collins. What a win. 45-22 the final. Some Gatorade to boot.
Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.